Hey guys, welcome back to Factorio. This is Eddie Man. Warptorio, episode number four. The last episode we went ahead and got Red Science up and running here. And I'll show you guys what we did. Okay, so we got basic red up and running. And that's great and everything. We got logistics uh, researching here, so that's good. Um, we have some attacks. Let me go ahead and just load up some iron here for ammo. And do we have enough belts? Yeah, we have enough belts. So we're not going to waste really that much um, iron on that right now. Okay. We have these turrets here that are taking a beating. So let's go ahead and give them some more ammo. All right. I wanted to make 10 more repair packs. So we're just gonna pick, pick, just pick off right where we last left off here, and proceed forward. All right. So even these terrors over here are getting some action as well too. All right. I know that I'm spending too much time warping to other places when I should be um, increasing our. Uh, production and getting um, more things unlocked and stronger within the base here but there's really not, not that much space to play around with so, um, so yeah, we're just gonna have to take it as slow as possible each time we warp here All right, so I'm gonna call that a quit for that one logistics is done um, let's hold out for our research right now. Uh, I know I got access to red science automatically now. Um, but I think we'll be okay for a little bit. Uh, let's go ahead and grab another turret here. We'll go ahead and put that down here. We got plenty of coal, so I don't need to replace those four. Okay, we need to get turrets automated. And that's not going to be for a little bit while longer um, I do need to resupply my base here with ammo so let's go ahead and every for every 200 piles stacks of iron plates we only get 50 ammunition that's uh, a little crazy huh so we're gonna we're gonna try to stay here as long as we can. Um, what I want to eventually do is oh, let's finish this wall here. Um, setting up this uh, smelting column here, or a tiny column. Um, eventually, I want to connect resources to them. Um, maybe like an underground belt of something of some sort and then it splits to the two sides and then every time we warp to another another planet it just we just have to reconnect it now the iron is all the way over there it doesn't make sense to connect that right now so we won't all right, let's get at least 20 in there all right let's make a run for iron again like I said last episode we're not gonna do copper this time around all right honestly I don't have to knock these trees down but why not okay so they're coming in full spurts here And they're getting aggressive. So what do we need next? Well, we need to um, solidify some resources coming in uh, so we can better start crafting things. Um, now, I do want to start making some iron gears and maybe some 
copper cables. So let's go ahead and set that up as well here. And right now we'll just put that here and here. And we'll give that a power pole. Okay. And I know that's going to eat my resources, but I think that'll be a good start today. So if I need to make uh, green circuits, I have the cables already ready to go. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and supply you with some more resources. Okay. And we got some red packs lined up here. Let's go ahead and pick a expensive resource. Let's do physical projectile damage. I know it's going to be a while to make, but I think it'll be worth the research uh, investment on that. And we'll go ahead and give you a little bit more of the rules. Okay. All right, so we have an issue here with ammo again. So I think it's time to go pick up. Oh boy. I left myself with no ammo. It's time to stop picking up here. Now we need ammo here, and then we need to pick up power, and then we'll warp out of here. Now the stone walls, I'm contemplating if I should leave them in the world or not. Uh, eventually we're probably going to have to. All right, now we just gotta we just gotta wait or uh, just gotta hold out for a minute here. Power, so I'll just have to craft the ammo. That's okay. About 10 seconds left. Okay. Oh my goodness. Really? Really? <laughs> I guess I picked a good time to uh, warp there, huh? All right. The resources are far away again, but. Power is not. Power is not far. All right. So let's get ourselves acquainted here with this world by building up power. Yeah, if I could do it. Okay. 
Okay, we are good to go there. So we need copper, right? Copper is the name of the game this time. So let's go ahead and set up copper. We always need iron. And we don't need trees right now. So I'm gonna go heavy on the copper right now. And then maybe iron, we'll start with two electric mining drills. Okay, and obviously we're going to need to put some defenses out here. One more turret, and I didn't leave myself with that much ammo. So. Okay, it's okay. All right. Oh, and this is going to be power out here, isn't it? So maybe. Eh. Yeah, let's connect the power. Eventually, we're going to have to anyway, right? So. Coal rock, nice. When I see these, I, I go for them. All right, so we've gone ahead and set up the iron here. Uh, let's set up a proper defense for that right in here. Okay, um, we're gonna have to get some ammo. We have plenty of coal right now, so we're not going to worry about coal on this map. And I want to get my stockpile of stone over here. Mix, cook up some more bricks. Let's do that. How are we doing here? Okay, that's good. All right. You just make that. Oh, they don't have enough inserters. That's not good. Make those. That's not good at all. Oh, I wanted to check science. How's science doing? Science is good. Okay, we are good. We will need to be making ammo like it's no one's business. Let's do that. Okay, so that's secured there. Oh, we need more power here. Sorry about that, guys. You need some ammunition, so let's go put that in there. Let's go pick up this. All right, and now we need some iron. Without a doubt, we need iron. OK, 
Okay. Let's get these to at least 20. You don't even have enough. You only have 10 between the two. All right. So eventually we're going to want to set up the belts to come down here and start pulling iron into <clears throat> these melting columns. But right now, I don't think that's the best course of action. Okay. I'll just have these manually smelt right now. We need some more ammo. Okay, thirteen, ten, and nine. These are twelve, sixteen, and nine, so we need more. Eleven. And 12, and we need up there some more iron. Yay, we are out of iron. And then copper came to this world to collect the copper. 22, 14. Drop that all those coal off at the base. So we got room to pick up stuff in this wood too. I gotta stop chopping the wood down. <laughs> Cause I have plenty of it. Alright, let's go in here and get rid of some of this coal. Okay, and then wood. Stone. <clears throat> All right, so let's make a splitter here. So I think the splitter is going to go like this and then we'll just go like that and then we'll hook up the iron from there maybe I can do something like this as we can right now. I already seen some biters. Okay, so this is a long stretch. So I might as well just run it back and forth for now. I know you guys want to see me get out of the burning phrase, uh, but it's a little harder this in this uh, challenge here with the biter set to crazy, 
crazy settings. Good with no, we're not. We're not good with ammo. In the front here. Okay. And these guys have seen action already. Squeeze in some more of stone brick. Production. <clears throat> Coal is still good. Copper is awesome. Iron is kaput. Um, and two miners is not enough for our needs, but it's a start. I don't think I'm gonna do. Um, mining drill so far away next time unless the iron is closer to the platform um, let's go ahead and no let's not do that because the more you do that the more iron we're going to need to supply that I should just give it all the iron that we have. Okay. Because we're going to start seeing a increase in that fighter aggression. So a warp this time is two minutes. So we're going to try to hold out here as best as we can. We're going to have to start, we're going to have to decide when we're going to stay. Make a defense. I won't be able to do that until I start automating and getting supplies in here. Um, maybe I should automate turrets here. No iron. know how to walk around that should be okay right right we're starting starting to get attacks in the top as well <clears throat> make another round here of supplies. How are you guys looking? So turrets, turrets, turrets. Plenty of copper. for me what I should have done is I should have ran the belt in yeah I'll do that next oh shoot I forgot to supply this one
the turret or two. Coming in real slow this time. And I should be. My problem is the base should be a lot bigger than what it is um, because I'm not bringing resources in. And I can't be scared to bring belts in full of resources. And then I'm going to have to create another one of these smelter columns here. So that's my next goal is to smelt, create that secondary smelting column. Um, but right now I am way over time for this episode. So I'm going to go ahead and end this one here. I want to thank you guys so much for joining me in this episode of Factorio Warptorio. If you haven't yet, please go ahead and consider throwing me a like for the video. It really helps me and the channel out. And if you want to stay up with everything Eddie Man, please subscribe for the channel as well right now thank you so much for joining me in, in this episode of factorio and like always i will see you guys next time bye bye